Hello, if you ever wonder about how much output power you can uh, get in theory from a Stirling engine, you can use this uh, integral calculation I put together and you find the uh, link in the description below and you can use either of these two files and uh, you can put in uh, input parameters here and you get out this now I also add so you can put in if you want over pressure in your system then the output power increase linear by by the over pressure but I will use atmospheric pressure at sea level because uh, uh, because uh, then the container structure will not be so heavy duty. Remember that this is an idealized Stirling engine. When you have fully isothermal behavior in the cold chamber uh, and in the co hot chamber and no dead space and the uh, displacer will move discontinuous uh, idealized as well. So, but it could be nice to know that it's not possible to get achieve more than this. Uh, hope you enjoyed to see this. Uh, have a nice uh, day.